Hi everyone. This is a small video about how to set up a free autos on Arduino Uno board. Setting up a free autos on Arduino involves five steps. Step one: download the Arduino IDE, preferably the versions after 1.6.8 or later. Step two would be download the free autos libraries from the GitHub.com. Step three: importing this downloaded free autos library onto the Arduino IDE. Step four would be open up the given example and upload this example called blink underscore analog read dot ino to your Arduino board. Step five, verify your output on the serial monitor and onboard LEDs. A very important information: download for download the link for all this downloads are given in the description section. Let's move on to the demonstration. Step one, in which download my Arduino IDE, the latest to version. In my case, the latest version which I'm going to download for the demonstration is 1.8.3, and I'm going to use a Windows version for this. Here, I made a download and running, and I've extracted my Arduino IDE here. Let's open up this and we'll see whether it has a free task library in it or not. Go to the go to the uh, Include library. You may not find in a library with the name free autos here. So this we're completing the step number one. Step number two: downloading the free autos library from the GitHub website. So from this website, I'm going to download the free autos library. And after downloading, I'll be getting an SNSD file. For my easy selecting process, I'm renaming renaming that library into the free autos. Let's be completing the step number two. Step number three: have to put this free autos library on the Arduino. For this, copy this free autos library folder, get into Arduino IDE folder, get into library section, paste it inside of them. With this, you have imported the free autos library manually onto Arduino IDE. With this, we are completing the step number three. Let's open up the Arduino IDE and verify whether the free attach library has been included in the Arduino IDE. No. Go to set sketch section and then include library. Now you may find an option for free attach here. This is the step number three. Move on to the step number four. Step number four will be opening up the example provider under the free attach option. For my demonstration purpose, I'm going to take in a blink and score analog read. I'll compile this. This particular program is trying to use in a two tasks. One is blinking LED with the help of pass blink function. Another one is reading the analog input to analog channel zero. That is done by using in a task name called task analog read. So to create a two task, we call the two x create X task create functions here, and once you are created, it will call the corresponding calling function, which is task blink to perform the blinking operation with a delay of one second. And then the second task we are trying to read the analog value through the analog channel zero, and printing out the serial code with the baud rate of 9600. So before uploading, ensure that your Uno board has been connected to a corresponding port. In my case, it is connected with the so with this, I'm going to upload my code onto the Arduino board. So here we're completing our step number four. Let's verify the output number output of your program. That is step number five. In my case, I'm trying to do try to do a two operation. One is analog read, and the one is blink. So get into two options: serial monitor, verify what is output you're getting. Right now, my analog channel zero is connected to a five volt supply of Arduino board, which gives 1024 as the output. In case if I connect to a ground terminal, it gives a zero as the output. So serial port is performing the operations what you are expected. Let's move on to the second task, which is linking an LED. So on my you know, board, I can see there is an LED which is blinking for one second delay. 
with this we are completing our step number five we have successfully uploaded the free autos onto the audino board thanks for watching